Welcome to another episode of Olja för Blåbär. I'm standing here in Freiburg and um, we stopped by this really interesting house. Uh, and I'm meeting with a guy here who can tell us more about it. So, who are you? Can you present yourself a little bit? Yeah, hi, I'm Patrick. I'm working for the Badische Landwirtschaftliche Hauptverband. It's the farmer organization here in Baden. And my job are public relations and work with media. So you're very, very, very welcome to get your questions yeah. from me. Yeah. So this building we have in front of us, uh, can you tell us a little bit about it? Yeah, it's our central building where all of our um, people, referees, are working here. And it's so to say it's the house of farmers here in Baden. And it's new built two years ago. And we decided to build a house on the rules of sustainability, which we used 90% of the house is built out of wood. And everything comes from black forest. And we use the highest standard of technology to make it very sustainable. And we, so we don't need much energy from outside for heating and such. Do you have anything like uh, backup power or do you, are you connected to the grid or how does it work? We are, we are connected to the, uh, to the grid, yep. so we, uh, but we use our solar panels on the roof to uh, produce the energy for our house. Mm -hmm and um, especially for heating systems. Yes, you can see our house is covered fully with glass, so um, we don't need any power to heat the building. And especially in this area of Germany, in Freiburg, it's always very warm in summer times. This is why we use the water of a little um, river here, yeah. mm -hmm. just around the corner, and we use the water and summer times to cool down the, uh, the building so it's always best climate conditions in your house. Okay. Yeah, so I mean in case we let's say we have a blackout would you be able to run the building on your solar panels or how does yeah. this would be would be possible yeah may when it's happening in winter times it would be possible because because you cannot store no. the energy no. yeah but it would be possible right, okay. and we don't need so much energy right no. now. No? Uh, we went around a little bit here in Freiburg and we can see solar panels almost all, all everywhere. Do you know how many solar panels or how much solar energy you use in Freiburg? I mean something... I don't, sorry, that I don't know how much solar energy no. we're no. actually no. producing no. about practice that in this part we have so much sun energy mm -hmm. uh, to use so it's especially around here in Freiburg we have some quarters which, which run very, uh, without any, yeah, any more energy, no. they just produce it themselves. Yes. And you said something, you, you have a background from the agriculture business. Uh, can you say anything about uh, uh, the agri or local production of food and so on? Do you know anything how it works in Freiburg? Do you have... Yeah. Yeah, um, Freiburg and the whole part in Baden is uh, signed by very small farming conditions. So in, yeah. compared to all, all other parts of Germany, we have the smallest farms um, here. And that's why we not so easy can run on the, uh, on the big markets. So we find our own way to be sustainable. It means Especially we diversify our farms a lot, so we produce vegetables and wine and food and grain and everything in one farm to make it more sustainable. Yeah? Yeah. I'm really interested. Thank you for taking your time. Yeah, you're welcome. Yeah, bye. Thank you. you too.